Hi, I'm Declan, and in this video, I'm going to share with you some information I've learned on how to fix audio problems when using piano on Zoom. So this is for people like piano teachers, piano students, or people that just want to play music to other friends through Zoom. So the problem I was finding is when you play continuous music, the sound levels were dropping up and down, and it was uh, pretty poor sound quality. Uh, it wasn't so bad when you're doing individual notes with gaps in between. Um, and this is due to how Zoom's software compresses the, uh, the, the signal, which is um, designed for voice, and it helps to keep out background noises. So it's pretty good when you're speaking to students, but when you're actually trying to play some continuous music, it's not so good. So I'll show you how to fix that problem now. I'll show you first how to fix this problem on a computer and later I'll show you how to fix it on a phone. So if you're on a computer, you go into the Zoom app and when you're on the home screen, you'll see the top right hand side, there's a little settings cog. So you click on that cog and this brings you through to a screen here. So you go, the third one down is audio. And the first thing we want to do is to untick the automatically adjust microphone volume box. So we take that off. Next, we go to the advanced button on the bottom right. We tick the first box, which is show in meeting option to enable original sound from microphone. Uh, so the original sound is the key word here because we don't want Zoom software to interfere with the audio. And then we take off this one here, the suppress persistent background noise. We want to disable that and suppress intermittent background noise, disable that as well. So what we're doing in effect is taking off Zoom's software that is interfering with the sound because it thinks it's background noise and we want the original sound to come through. So when you go into the normal view for your meeting, you will see on the top left of the screen, there is a little button that says turn on original sound. I'll switch this button. So and this is how the music sounds. So when you are playing music, you want to turn on original sound and that will get you the better sound quality. If you find that there's a lot of background noise, especially if you have a conference call with a lot of people in it, um, then you might want to turn off original sound so that you take advantage of Zoom software that is designed to cut out background noise. But for most instances, it's fine just to leave on original sound for your piano Zoom calls. Oh yeah, one thing before I forget. <laughs> um, for anybody that is using Zoom on a mobile, I'll just show you what to do for that. So especially if you're a teacher, uh, it's better to, to use a laptop or, or a desktop, ideally. Um, but some of the students or other people might have iPhones. So on an iPhone, you go into the Zoom app and then on the bottom right, you've got settings. So you go into there and then you go into meetings. And then if you scroll down, you'll see use original sound. So you wanna put that on, so activate that. So everybody that is playing music on either side should be using original sound. Thanks for watching, I hope that's been of use and please subscribe to my other videos on the Deck Play YouTube channel.